Imagine two satellites colliding at about 20,000 miles per hour and all the debris shooting out, possibly hitting other spacecraft. That's the mess the European Space Agency is warning the public about. Its worst fear is an unstoppable chain reaction of collisions at Earth's most populated area of orbit. Scientists are already tracking more than 18,000 objects in space and 750,000 small fragments that could cause serious damage. The energy contained in a one centimeter particle hitting a satellite at that velocity roughly corresponds to an exploding grenade. But of all the objects being tracked, there's only 1,100 spacecraft currently carrying out a mission. The ESA recommends countries take their satellites out of orbit within 25 years of the end of their mission, but that often doesn't happen. And with satellites becoming cheaper, the congestion is only getting worse. Roughly 12,000 new satellites are expected to go into orbit in the coming years. Besides convincing spacefaring countries to bring their crafts back to Earth when they're done with their missions or pushing them out into less populated areas of space, the ESA is working on technology to rein in satellites. But it notes the problem will only be fixed if all spacefaring nations do their part. We have generated a global problem that can only be solved on a global scale. It needs a global response. 